Actually, we came out last year for this. So um, when we finished last year, all the parents enjoyed it. We had a great time. The kids loved it. So we were anxious to get back. And as soon as we found the date, you know, signed up for it and came back. Well, uh, we skate uh, with Team Toledo out at the Ice House, and um, uh, we were just contacted by Michael Keedy from the Mud Hens and the Walleye Organization and asked us to get involved. We've, we've skated here last year as well, and so it's a whole lot of fun for the kids, and it's, it's a, we, uh, a lot of hockey games, and uh, uh, everyone has a great time. Out of Tam O'Shanner, my son plays on the Mites, so um, I, I kind of direct their Mite division out there, so I just hooked up with these guys with, through Mike Keedy, and brought the kids down here. This is our second year doing it. Last year we did it also. For us it's the uh, the American development method from USA Hockey and the cross ice uh, training for the kids which is uh, has been adopted to teach them close uh, close end skills and uh, different hockey skills in the open ice at this age. So we, we look at it more as a development. So. Uh, it's been awesome. Um, I was telling the parents you know when we play our games almost every player where you know scores a goal they all get more touches on the puck a lot more skating. I know my son plays goalie and he faces you know, 75 shots a game instead of say 10. Uh, the skating's improved, all their stick handling, it's, it's been a great approach. It's through USA Hockey and it starts at their mini mites as a younger group and instead of focusing just on games they teach the kids um, developing uh, their skill levels and stuff like that until they get up into their higher. Right now, they this is the age group that the kids learn more of their development from like age six on to ten. So instead of worrying about the games, and that so this is kind of nice because our ADM through Tam O'Shanner is all a lot of um, practices more than his games. So this is kind of like a tournament for the kids. So they have a good time. We were just sitting in the dressing room, and last year our dressing room had couches and a flat screen. So they were all amazed, and I was just telling the parents, I think the kids got lost watching SpongeBob. And it's like, no, we got to come out and play. And they're like, but SpongeBob's not over. So they were all anxious, and of course they're sitting there watching TV. But, you know, they love coming out. I think they love the fact that uh, the Huntington Center is so nice with the seats and everything. They really love coming out and, you know, feeling like they're at a professional arena. Oh, we, have all, we all have a good time. We all intermingle with everybody, and then we get to learn parents from other rinks and stuff like that it's fun oh they're so excited are you kidding they're, they're really excited and a lot of our kids are going to be participating in the shootout between the periods and uh, they can't wait you know they, they've been talking about it for weeks when you sign up you pretty much get a ticket to go to the walleye game after and are you a big walleye fan yes do you have a favorite player evan rankin